Hi, I'm Nicholas Bell with Ion Cinema, and welcome to our countdown of the 150 most anticipated foreign films of 2020. Uh, at number five, we have Ildiko and Yeti's The Story of My Wife, uh, which is a German, Hungarian, Italian co production uh, from Agnetti, produced by Monica Mex, Marinade, who directed Tony Erdman, of course, Janine Jakowski, Jonas Dornbach, uh, amongst several others. Uh, Ildiko and Yeti ranks so highly on our list, uh, mostly due to her 2017 feature on Body and Soul, uh, which won the Golden Bear at the Berlin Film Festival and broke a nearly 20-year hiatus from filmmaking for In Yeti. Uh, the, co the nature of the co-production is reflected in the cast, uh, which is led by Lea Seydoux, Louis Garrel, who uh, will also have new projects from Woody Allen and Rachel Lang lined up for next year, Jasmine Trinka, Gies Naber, Joseph Hader, and Sergio Rubini. It's based on a 1942 novel by Hungarian writer Milan Fust, and it's about a sea captain who makes a bet in a cafe that he will marry the first woman who walks into it, uh, which will be played by Leia Seydoux. We predict that Inyeti's latest will be a return to Cannes for her, potentially in the main competition, based on the fact that her last feature won the Golden Bear and the uh, producers on this Project. Just to give a rundown on Inyeti's past, she won the Golden Camera at Cannes in 1989 for My 20th Century, which was uh, a restored version of that was shown at Berlin, I think, in 2018. Uh, so we can look forward to seeing that on Blu-ray sometime in the near future, I'd imagine, which previously has been unavailable. She's competed twice in Venice with 1994's Magic Hunter and 1997's Tomas and Julie. And Simon the Magician uh, competed in Locarno in 1999, and then of course she ended uh, her 18-year hiatus with On Body and Soul in 2017, which took home the Golden Bear. Thank you. Hey, this is Eric from MyOnCinema.com. If you want to support us, subscribe below. For more reviews, interviews, film festival coverage from Sundance, Cannes, Toronto, you want to check out these guys on this side.